Hello Universe, it's Chipsy. Thank you so much for visiting my channel. This is my September update for the Pan as Old as Time. This is a project sponsored by the Fantastic Ladies of Facebook, which we go through the oldest palette in our collection and we've been working on it all year. This project started in January and it's going to finish up in December of this year. So we're in the last quarter. So of course I think those of us who don't feel like we've made the progress we want to make, we're rushing to get into the home stretch. The palette that I chose was a 1992 Avon palette. It had eight eyeshadows in it and two blushes and then I glued three additional eyeshadows into it. This is what it looks like currently. One, two, and three are the ones I glued in and these three, the turquoise, brown, and olive are three of the original palettes. Um, I was working on reaching side pan on the olive, which I did reach, and now I was I started trying to expand the pan by working up and over on the brown, but I've just been trying to see if I can at least get to a halfway point, maybe by the end of October. I'm using these two darker colors mainly to uh, set the eyeliner, but I'm also trying to reach above into the crease and above the crease slightly and on the outer edges just to get some more use. Two of the shadows that were in the pan I really didn't care for, so I Franken-panned them together. I Franken-panned both the black and a lighter green and put it in this old Aziza compact and I've expanded that pan slightly. I've been trying to reach into this a little bit um, with a, a thicker blending brush like this just to touch it lightly because it powders up very easily. It's just a side effect of my Franken panning and just touch it right across here and then blend it across just to get some use out of it. Um, because these are such dark colors, they're hard for me to use. The other thing that I did with this palette is I franken pan the two blushes together because one of the blushes was so red, I simply, I got tired of trying to figure out how to use it. I tried to use it underneath foundation. I've tried so many different things to make that work for my skin. I finally franken pan them together and I also put it in a Ziza compact and I have got so much use off of this now guys. I might actually be able to finish this before the end of the year. Tons of pan on this now. Very excited by that. So these two are also part of the project because they came out of the original pan and I'm going to keep working on the olive and the brown. The three on the bottom are the ones that I especially want to try to finish because they're original to this pan. This one, this one, and this one I added, so they're probably not nearly as old as this, the other originals are. So I'm going to keep working on it. This is my update for September for the Pan as Old as Time project with the Fantastic Ladies. Have a great day, day guys. Toodaloo.